recognize the urgent needs of Massachusetts immigrants and to speak out. Recently, a group of immigrant rights advocacy organizations traveled to the Massachusetts State House to deliver a letter to Governor Deval Patrick and to President-elect Barack Obama demanding more fair and just immigration policies. Youth members from the Welcome Project and Centro Presente, both of Somerville, presented their letters to the governor's office as part of the Welcoming Massachusetts campaign. The purpose of today's event was to, to really let folks know in this time of great hope and joy and celebration of the holiday season and also having our, our uh, new president, President-elect Obama, we also want to make sure that um, both President-elect Obama and Governor Patrick um, remember to keep uh, the kind of the situation of immigrants in mind and, and remember that um, really we need just and humane immigration reform and, and we really hope that that's a, a top priority for President-elect Obama and we hope that Governor Patrick um, also supports this by helping us in the, uh, enact uh, just and humane immigration policies on the state level as well. The campaign seeks to affirm Massachusetts as a commonwealth that respects the dignity of all people and create a more welcoming environment for immigrants. Diana Bell had suggested that he check to see whether David Seamus or David Morales, some of Governor Patrick's chief aides who deal with policy and immigrant rights issues, would be available to talk with us as well as. My name is Clevia Kamara and I represent the Welcoming Project in Summer. My message is that we as immigrants have the same rights as human beings. We are human beings. We should be treated as equal. My name is Sonny Perez. I'm from Centre Presente. And my message is that we all human beings and I want to live in a city where I can be treated as equal and not, not to be discriminated by my color, my skin and language. I think the elections uh, were essentially round one and after the inauguration then the real work starts to try to push for just humane immigration reform in Congress. We also need to do a lot of work in our respective states to make sure that we are isolating the politics of fear and hate against immigrants.